Hello, hello, hello. Good morning, everyone. Megala shout out to all the subscribers and followers of this channel. And if you are new to my channel, please. <laughs> One, subscribe, two, like, share, don't forget to ring the bell buttons for the ne next notification. Three, like, leave a comment, subscribe. Four, subscribe. All right, so our lesson for today is still on statistics that is finding the variance and the standard deviation. So this is involved on in, um, ungrouped data. Yeah? And this will be uh, explained in English and Filipino. The variance and the standard deviation. The variance is or S squared and the standard deviations are the most practical and commonly used measures of variation. The standard deviation allows us to immediately compare the spread of different sets of scores and enables us enables us also to interpret the scores of a given set of data. The variance is defined as the point of the sum of the squared deviations from the mean divided by the n minus 1, while the standard deviation is the square root of the variance. Thus, the formulas are given below. Okay, so these are the formula for variance and the standard deviations. So, s square is equal to sum of... Uh, the mean, the score minus the mean square over n minus 1 and the standard deviation is the square root of the sum of the uh, mean min, uh, or score minus the mean squared over n minus 1 okay next these formulas use the mean division method and tell us to follow the following steps. Number one, calculate the mean. Two, get the difference between each score and the mean. Get the square root of difference of this this difference, so this square, the third. Fourth, the sum of the square division in step or get the sum of the square root square division in step three. And 5, divide the sum of the squared differences by n minus 1, and the number obtained is called variance. Take the square root. Now, so, you square root na yun, that is the standard deviation. Alright. So, important th uh, points regarding the calculation of the standard deviation. So, one, the standard deviation cannot be negative. So, impossibly negative yan, hindi pwede. And the standard deviation of a set of data is zero if and only if the observations are of equal values. Three, as a rough guide, the standard deviation should have a value which is equal to approximately one-third of the range. And four, if a constant is added to its observation in a set of data, then the standard deviation of the new set of data is the same as the standard deviations of the original set of data. Okay, so let's have an example. The price of 250 grams powdery soap of leading brand was recorded from 10 supermarkets. So the prices in pesos were as follows. Okay. So we have 90, 73, 78, 79, 83, 895, 7, 
77, 79, and 74, and 82, okay? So, we will use the pen, right? Okay, so, the total, no? So, if we are going to get the sum of x here, okay, that is equal to uh, 810, then, uh, to get the mean, para makuha natin yung mean, so that is 810 divided by uh, 10, kasi 10 po ang ating given, there are 10 items, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, okay, so that is 81, no, so because 810 divided by 10 is 81, okay, then subtract natin dito, 81, 90 minus 81 is equals to 9, 73 minus 81 is negative 8, 78 minus 81 is equals to negative 3, 79 minus 81 is negative 2, 83 minus 81 is a positive 2, 95 minus 81 is 14, then 77 minus 81 is negative 4, 79 minus 81 is negative 2, and then 74 minus 81 is negative 7, and 82 minus 81 is 1. And then so square natin to, so 9, 9 times 9 is equals to 81. 64, 9, 4, 4, 14 times, 14 is equal to 196, then 16, 4, 49, and 1, okay? So here, if we are going to get the sum that is about 0, uh, so, importante makuha natin yung variance. So, the sum of uh, x, no? Minus x bar squared or the, the sum of x minus the mean. That is 428. Okay? So, pag kinuha natin yung variance, no? Okay. Sa ibang book may, may ang symbol ng variance niya parang ganito, no? Okay. So uh, check it out. No, pero that is the sum of ano, no? So in other books. So we have the sum of x minus x bar squared over the n, no? So, the N, okay, so we have 428 divided by 9, okay, so 9 ba to? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, because N minus 1, no, N minus 1, so 9, 10 minus 1 is 9, so the answer is, uh, 47.55. Okay, so this is the variance. The sum of the divisions from the mean is always 0. No? So the sum of the deviation from the mean. No? Okay, so division from the mean that is equal to 0. And the standard division measures approximately the average distance that set of observation is from the mean. So, pag kinuha naman natin yung standard deviation nito, S is equals to the square root of the sum of no, the, so, ang square root nyan is the sum of uh, x minus the mean or division from the mean squared over n minus 1, okay, so that is 
square root of 47.55 or about 6, no? So, kaya ganyan, ibig sabihin, approximately 6.89. Alright, so, ganyan po ang pag kuha ng variance and standard deviation with ungrouped data. No? So, this is ungrouped data. Next. Okay, so, for questions and clarifications, just write it at the comment section. Remember, gratitude is the best attitude. And before I go, please, um, please, um, salami, marami pong salamat sa patuloy niyo pong pag-support sa channel ito. Sana, sana po wala po, wag po kayong manawa. And, <clears throat> kung bago, if you don't forget to remember this guy. <music> Please subscribe like share Don't forget to ring the bell buttons like leave a comment and subscribe and uh shout out po sa team organic barcadas team international um team um, solid family teacher fe squad uh, Pinag Israel TV, everyone, to all my members, to Wena Vlogs, Avena Lea, Pinag Israel TV, Teacher Fair Channel, everyone out there who loves, um, please support, continue your support. Hindi pa po nabubuo yung, ano, yung promise ko for the Ellison. Ano? So, please, 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 um, continue support. Goodbye. Love you all. Bye-bye. God bless you.